I guess there. So, uh, Crudfield would be good. Uh, Hades would be good. No, duplicates would be good. So first of all, I just want to say it's very windy up here. Um, if you didn't know, I actually filmed in an attic and it's very, very windy. Hopefully it won't be too distracting. Obviously I'm not going to know until I edit, but if you can hear any like, background noise or anything, hopefully it won't be too distracting. Hello everyone, and welcome to Kimmy's Shrine. So once a week I do Disney themed videos. So last one I did was actually my high street one. So if you've not seen that, please go check that out. And today is actually finally part two of my Toys for a Pound mystery minis. Now I actually had to separate this because I actually got this uh, from Toys for a Pound, which is an app, not sponsored in any way, but it's an app that you can actually get like toys for a pound it's normally like one pound two pounds or five pounds so you can get different types of toys on there obviously I tend to get more Disney ones um, but this particular one I actually bought loads of mystery minis I literally spent like 20 pounds on mystery minis I had too many to do in one video so I had to separate it so this is part two so if you watch part one you'd know that some of the things I actually had in there were some Toy Story ones so I've actually got some more Toy Story ones then that the other one was like series two or something and then these ones are series three so these are actually from the Toy Story 4 ones this is what it looks like now as I'm filming this they are still currently available on the app at the moment but the app does change quite frequently um, so I would always say just keep like checking because for me personally like I said because I do actually have the app I think they've got a website as well and also like a Facebook group so obviously they keep up to date as to things what's on there so personally I would just say just keep having a look especially if there's something on there that you really want um, but yeah like I said so this is actually a series 3 of the Toy Story 4 ones now I really want to get more Toy Story 4 because um, I have a lot of Toy Story stuff, just not a lot of Toy Story 4 things. So I've actually got four here to open. So I'm just going to grab my, oh, grab my scissors. But these ones, I think they're just normal little figurines because another thing that I've got as well, which I'll do in a moment, is actually some villains ones. But those are like a razor rubber type thing. So I think these ones are just figurines. So I'm just going to open the first one. Oh, she says. Uh, oh! Oh, so I've got Jesse. Now, I've already got this one. Um, I can't remember if I've done these ones before or whether I got Jesse in the last one I did. So I don't know whether it's sort of similar characters, but the fact that the other one said series two and this one says series three, I was hoping it'd be different types of characters, but I don't mind that I've actually got Jesse again. Just for one, I don't actually have a lot of Jesse things, so it doesn't really mind. Or two, if I do actually end up getting duplicates, I'll probably end up just giving to charity shops, to be honest. So that was the first one. So I'm just gonna open the second one. This one seems quite big, so I'm hoping it's like, buzz or someone because it is quite big oh um oh my god okay you're gonna test my knowledge now what is this character called um oh my, for some reason the name Trixie's come to mind but I have no idea I can't remember because I haven't got my phone because if you know I actually vlog these videos so I can't even cheat and look at my phone um, I'm trying to remember what his character is and share my, my Toy Story knowledge because I'm not, not as I'm a huge Toy Story fan, but I'm just like, I don't remember every, because there's so many characters I don't remember, <laughs> and these are the newer ones. I don't know, for some reason Trixie's come to mind, I'm probably getting people in the comments shouting at me being like, that's completely wrong, but... Uh, yeah, uh, I honestly can't remember her name, so I'm really sorry. Like, yeah, again, testing my Disney knowledge. So, yeah, just gonna open the next one. So, oh no! <laughs> I got two, so I got two the same. So um, what I will do actually, because our charity shops at the moment aren't open, so I will definitely do like a little bundle. So I will put Jesse and this little one um, in the uh, in the bundle because I was thinking, okay, I don't need two of that character, especially because I can't remember the character's name. But yes, yeah, so I've got the last one. This one seems quite small. I don't know who that could be for that size, but let's have a. Oh. Um, again, I don't know if I've already got this one though, so it is a little alien, so that's kind of cute. Um, I do actually have an alien video I want to do for you guys, because I've realised through the last, say, two or three years, I've actually got a lot of alien things from Toy Story, so um, I will actually do it uh, like in my Pixar playlist, I'm actually going to do an aliens one, but I don't know if I've got this one as well, so I might have to check. So, at the moment, not a very good start on the basis that I actually have quite a lot of these already, but like I said, I will obviously do like a bundle, I will 
them to charity shops once they open because at the moment like I said they are closed at the moment so once they do open I will definitely do that because I will be definitely going to charity shops because I have really really missed going to charity shops so that would be one thing I do is that obviously when I actually go there to see what Disney things I can find I would actually then give these to, to certain ones right so the next one, so one, two, three, four, five, six. So I've actually got six of these. So these are Disney villains, and they're actually um, like rubber razor type things. I've had stuff like this before. I think I've had a frozen one before. And another one, so I don't know if I did like a princess one, but I hadn't had these ones, um, the actual villains ones. That's why I thought I'd get these. That's why I thought I'd get them quite a few. Because I am actually trying to get more villains things. Now, obviously, I'm not going to use these as like rubbers and things, because I kind of find personally they don't actually work that well as rubbers. Because I think because the actual things on them are coloured, I find that they don't personally work. Right, so I just opened it. Oh, okay, so the first one, oh, she says. So the first one is actually the Queen, so I will just get that one, so that's the Queen from Snow White. This one you kind of have to make, but yeah, like I said, I wouldn't ever use these as rubbers. I just thought they were kind of cool, just kind of have as like little figurines, so, and they're actually bigger than I thought, for some reason I thought they'd be a bit smaller, but yeah, so that one is the, the Queen there, um, so good start. Now, one of the ones I would like to have, I would like to have a Hades. Uh, Maleficent. Oh, it does actually say limited edition character is actually Corona Deville, so it'd be cool to have that one. Um, possibly Queen of Hearts, because I don't actually have a lot of Alice in Wonderland things, that's why I've never done a video. So, let me check. Oh. So, that one. Oh, so yeah, so I just got the Queen of Hearts, so I'll just put that together now. So, yes, like I said, I've never actually used these as like a rubber or anything because the fact they've actually got a colour on them, obviously, you can get away with the white ones, that'd be fine. But the fact they've actually got a colour on them, I kind of feel like would they actually rub out pencil? Because I think. I used to have stuff like this, I think, as a child. Obviously not Disney ones, but I think just other characters. And I'm pretty sure they didn't actually work, unless obviously you use the, the white bit. But yeah, so that one is the Queen of Hearts. Like I said, I don't actually have a lot of Alice in Wonderland things, so I'm actually quite happy to get that. Right, so the next one. So like I said, so uh, Credit Field would be good. Uh, Hades would be good. No, Duplicates would be good. So that one. Oh, okay, so Maleficent. So Maleficent, I would say she's like my favorite. I just feel like I've got a lot of Maleficent and Ursa things. So they're the two that I kind of like. Um, but I wouldn't say they're like my favorite villains because we you know me, Scar is my number one favorite. But I do actually have a lot of Ursula and Maleficent things. All right, so this one. So, oh, get her horns on the right way can I <laughs> this one's got a few more pieces to it um so oh Aha. Oh, so our horns don't really want to stay on <laughs> so that is oh oh I might have to glue these on to make sure they stay on but I don't know if that's supposed to go on a certain way because I was oh unless I've got it on the wrong way maybe that was a problem i had it on the wrong way or maybe it just doesn't why can't i do this ah aha done it yeah so that one is the maleficent one there so like i said i don't really have favorites but i definitely have more maleficent and ursa things i think it's just because like for example primark seems to be the main place that i do tend to get most of my villain stuff from because that's the only place i find I actually do villains things that i kind of find that they're the main characters that they always tend to do uh credit for they do a few things off as well and the evil queen from snow white but i find that a lot of things i've got just happen to have those two characters on there right so we're on to number three so at the moment we're doing good with no duplicates obviously it's so difficult to tell what's in them because they're completely covered up they're completely like you know haven't got a clue oh Jafar so I'm happy with that one so I did say that Jafar was actually one that I wanted um I think I've only got a few Jafar things I haven't got a lot because uh, I do actually have a Disney um I do actually have a Disney villains playlist so obviously I will link it uh, oh, he's got a very tiny body. <laughs> so I was just looking at his body size. So that is his body compared to his head because I thought, oh, maybe I was missing a part or something. But yeah, he's just got like a teeny tiny body. But um, yeah, oh, I'm missing something. What am I? Ah, so I just realized that I'm missing his feather in his hat. 
Now I don't have a lot of, um, say, of one particular character, so that's why whenever I've done like a villains video, I've always done sort of um, like the male ones, the female ones, and then like the psychics and things like that. So I don't actually at the moment have enough, say, Jafar ones to do a whole video on Jafar. Um, I might, looking at it, I might actually have some more Maleficent stuff, so I might be able to do that because with Maleficent, obviously we've got the live action as well as the animated version, so there are obviously a few items that I've got from Vogue. But yeah, so that might be something I might do because I want to do some more villains things if I can. It's just at the moment I don't have enough to do one video. Like I said, that's why I've kind of had to put them, like group them together. Right, so down to the last two. We're doing well so far with no duplicates, so hopefully we can keep that going. What's this one? Oh no, I've got the evil queen again. So I've actually got two evil queens, so that's me saying that obviously I was doing so well not having any duplicates. So I'm not actually gonna open this, I'm gonna keep this wrapped up, and then obviously I'm gonna actually put this back in here. So um, again, I'm actually gonna give that to charity, so I'm gonna put that in the charity pile. So actually down to the last one. So like I said, so Hades would be cool to have, uh, Corot de Ville would be cool to have, and Ursula. So they'd be the ones that I would actually particularly like. Um, this is one reason I wanted to get quite a few of these, because I have learn especially because these are only a pound obviously on toys for a pound that like I kind of want to get quite a few just because um, like I said at the beginning you don't always know what's on there like sometimes with stuff like this you see them and then you go back to get more and they've gone um, there is actually a video coming up maybe next month on something that I actually bought a couple of months ago went to get more they sold out but then they've re put them on there so I actually bought some more on that particular one so hopefully these ones might be back on there if they're not at the moment and who do I have oh no <laughs> so I've actually got Maleficent again so that is two duplicates so like I said those ones I give to charity but I'm happy with the ones that I've got I got Queen of Hearts I got the Queen I got Maleficent I got Jafar uh, I've got an alien I've got I want to say Trixie. Why do I want to say Trixie? Is that right? Like, I'm not going to know until I finish it whether I got that right or not. So, I hopefully got it right. And then, obviously, I got Jesse as well. So, I'm happy with the ones I've got. Like I said, the other ones I'm just going to give to charity. So, yeah. So, that was it for my Toys for a Pound. Like I said, I do actually have another one coming up at some point. Um, I don't want to do too many Toys for a Pound ones in one go. Um, technically, this was actually supposed to be last week's video. But my last week, I did actually do was my High Street one. On the basis that I actually had quite a lot of items that were kind of new in asda and i didn't want you guys to miss out just in case you wanted them because they're available on their website so that's why i thought i'll do that one and then i've got this one but because i've got another toys for a pound to do at some point which is again another mystery minis one i didn't want to do too many in a row um my next one's actually going to be my toko kawaii subscription it is oh it is literally down here waiting so that's going to be my next video so if you're not already then please like and subscribe and get the bell notification so you're obviously get notified when that one goes up and that's it and i'll see you guys next time later days